It's that time of the year again, where we get a sneak peek at what brand new features are coming to SOLIDWORKS 2023. For engineers like us, this is our festive season, where we can all get a little overexcited and pass out on the sofa after a solid day digesting all of the new features. What goodies have Dassault System put into the next release of SOLIDWORKS? Well, there's a whole host of enhancements coming our way, and, as usual, we've picked out 10 of our favourites to keep an eye out for. Over the years, we've seen some huge additions to the SOLIDWORKS suite. This year is no different as the wider suite from PDM to simulation is also strengthened. While some of our favourite improvements that make this list may be a little more subtle this year, these enhancements are sure to help improve your productivity and streamline your workflow. So, here are our top 10 enhancements coming in SOLIDWORKS 2023. An already reliable tool, the Move Copy Bodies command gets an extra boost of power this year. We'll be able to utilize equations and global variables when translating and rotating bodies, with the additional inclusion of Euler's angular rotation. Modify the yaw, pitch, and roll of bodies about their center of mass or any point in your model. Not only that, but these dimensions are configurable to give an extra level of control to our designs and their variations. You might have noticed the engraved text on that last part. Extra support for single line fonts now means that inscribing thin text and stick fonts is possible in SOLIDWORKS 2023. Scribe these fonts into planar and curved faces with the wrap feature to make adding serial numbers and model names to your parts that little bit easier. We love a new feature that saves us time and money, particularly when it protects against costly mistakes and wasted material. Get alerted when your flat pattern exceeds your bounding box size in a sheet metal part with some new sensors. You can set your sensor to warn you when a flat pattern exceeds the width, length, area, or area blank values of a bounding box. And save yourself some valuable redesign time by catching mistakes early. Much like last year, SOLIDWORKS 2023 sees some helpful new improvements come to structure systems. Applying corner treatments to similar corners is a really welcome feature and will save you a bunch of time and clicks. Arrows indicate which corners are in each group and we can even zoom to selection to take us straight to our selected corners instead of hunting around for them. You'll find that we can even pattern connection elements like this gusset to similar corners as well, helping to further automate the structural design process. Profiles within structure systems now behave more like their weldment siblings. We can configure profiles for each set of structural members now. This should help improve performance and reduce the number of features we need to strengthen and bring more flexibility to structure systems. Perhaps a little more subtle than some of our other top enhancements. Number six is the ability to reset SOLIDWORKS to factory settings easily. We're always looking out for ways that speed up our workflows, and sometimes that can just be by decluttering our workspace. We've all lost a toolbar at some point, or have inherited a heavily customized workspace where we just can't find anything that we're looking for. Each tab of the customized window gains a reset button that allows you to reset the settings on the selected tab, 
command manager, or all the customizations. Our copy settings wizard gets an upgrade this year, with a new option to save out our current settings and reset SolidWorks to the default factory settings. Making patterns in assemblies just got easier. Once upon a time, we'd have had to create a few different patterns to configure this assembly. Now in SOLIDWORKS 2023, an assembly pattern that supports skipped instances also supports configurations, letting you design and modify your patterns more directly. This is a great new feature to help speed up performance and simplify your workflow. For many years, we've been able to happily swap out one part for another in an assembly and reattach any mates. SOLIDWORKS 2023 streamlines this process further by bringing with it additional options to replace individual instances or specific components within a subassembly. We also get a new preview of the replacement component. These are helpful new additions to an already useful tool that makes assembly modeling even more flexible. And as assemblies grow in complexity, SOLIDWORKS will bear some more of the load with a new system option to boost performance. Switching between lightweight and resolve modes can now be automatically handled by SOLIDWORKS to optimize performance when working with large assemblies and keep you focused on your designs. Of course, it's not just parts and assemblies that see some enhancement. Drawings can now be open from any level of the tree hierarchy. It won't matter if you select a part or subassembly from the feature manager tree, a table, or directly from the graphics area. If it has an associated drawing, you can open it. This will help speed up finding drawings and improve performance as reference parts and assemblies don't have to be opened or located anymore. A good drawing is a clear drawing. Clarity is always a priority, and with SOLIDWORKS 2023, our builds and materials gain a couple of superpowers. Bombs can now be filtered to easily see relevant data and the integrated search bar helps to narrow down a list of values, while custom filters can be applied with conditional logic to combine criteria. Any data which is manually overridden in a bill of materials is now flagged up by a highlight when the table is selected. We can customize this color and restore values individually by row, column, or reset the whole table. We can't wait to get our bombs and drawings working more intelligently for us and streamlining our workflows with SOLIDWORKS 2023. So that's our breakdown of our favorite enhancements coming to SOLIDWORKS 2023. These enhancements are sure to help improve your productivity and streamline your workflow, alongside those changes coming to the wider SOLIDWORKS suite. From PDM and Manage, to simulation and visualize. What are your favorite features coming in SOLIDWORKS 2023?